We're learning of another hire for the Jaguars coaching staff. You first heard about this from a push alert on the News for Jacks app not long before noon today. The Jaguars are set to hire the Buccaneers' Mike Caldwell as their next defensive coordinator. News for Jack Sports anchor Cole Peppers here. Cole, sounds like uh, Coach Peterson pretty connected with and familiar with Caldwell. Yeah, I would say that's a great way to say it. He's known him for a long, long time, and now he's bringing him into the fold here in Jacksonville. Hiring coordinators, typically the most important positions for a new head coach. Doug Peterson being an offensive-minded coach, so picking a defensive coordinator might be the most important decision he'll make this month. And today he made his choice going with Tampa Bay Bucks assistant Mike Caldwell as defensive coordinator according to a report from NFL Network's Mike Garofolo. Caldwell's 50 years old. It's his first shot as a coordinator. He has plenty of experience on the field. He played 11 years in the NFL for the Browns, Ravens, Cardinals, Bears, Eagles, and Panthers. Played a year with Doug Peterson in Philadelphia. That's where they first crossed paths. He also coached with Peterson in Philly. Most recently, he's been the inside linebackers coach in Tampa, where he gained a lot of praise from Bucks head coach Bruce Arians. We'll hear what Arians has to say about Caldwell coming up tonight at 6.30. It's interesting to see what Peterson has done so far. He chose a former head coach as a quarterback's coach, someone he had not previously worked with, so we went with experience. And now he's giving Caldwell his first shot as a coordinator, someone he's very familiar with. It'll be interesting to see if familiarity or resume is a more common hiring theme for Peterson in the coming days. Kent and Mary. Yeah, thank you, Cole. And coming up this Thursday on our News for Jags podcast, we're going to break down what this new hire could mean for the Jaguars. That's streaming free wherever you get your podcasts and on news4jags.com.